The type of art I do, I think, in the end, it's a, it's a form of visual storytelling. I try to use different approaches to how I tell stories, so sometimes they're maybe told abstractly, sometimes with a, with a more narrative feel to them, but in the end, I'm really just trying to tell different stories. Being in the Moog Sound Lab, to me, is almost like a... It's, it is a dream come true, because as a kid, I was really, I've always been interested in the idea of science in general, but mixing science with sound is even more personal to me. So, and, and just the, the history uh, and Bob's legacy and all that, just being within the foundation of that is really amazing. And then working with guys like Razor and Blade and, and having that be the accompaniment to what I'm working on and working on three set theremins and a Voyager. It's sort of a, an amalgamation of really, of all things that are interesting to me. So to be able to fuse those all together within this environment is something that I'll always remember and is really, really special. I've always found teachers in a lot of different ways and a lot of different professions. And I felt like Bob was a kindred spirit in a way, that he was trying to tap into something uh, maybe unseen or something larger than us through his medium and through his craft. So I really related to that because, again, in my own small way, I've always tried to to let my craft sort of guide me through life rather than guiding it or feeling that I was guiding it. And I feel like there's a, a similar sentiment in the way that we approached our work. I think the Bob Moog Foundation and myself uh, has a bright future and I, and I don't try to overthink what that is. I just feel like we're, we're all putting as much positive energy as we can into it and it's gonna lead in a positive direction. And to me, it's really fun to watch that blossom Instead of, I guess in the past, I used to sort of have an expectation or an idea in mind, and, and more and more I've just learned to, to sort of engage and then let go and, and just watch what happens, and, and that's become a lot more enjoyable. So I'm very excited to see what happens. Mm -hmm.